I started picking up these pieces of sea glass off the beach that I found here locally, and I started to want to wear them. I worked for other jewelers when I was a teenager, helping them make their own work. I got all into the welding and loved that, so I started making jewelry for myself. I go to the beach every single day. All of the sea glass, all the pieces that I make are all from pieces right in our area. If somebody buys a piece of my jewelry, they'll always have a piece of Capitola or Santa Cruz with them. Here's the rarest piece of sea glass that I've ever found. This color is one in 10,000 pieces. So if you haven't found one, don't be surprised. It took me 10 years of sea glass hunting. Every day I go, I don't always find a piece of sea glass but I always pick up trash, and I think that's part of my secret. I don't go to any special beach. I go to just these regular beaches, but I pick up the styrofoam and the cigarette butts and the plastic bags. I don't know if it's good karma or if it's just because you're down there and you, you know, picking up a nasty cigarette butt and then, hey, there's a piece of sea glass underneath it. But, you know, I believe in that give and take and helping keep the ocean clean and trash to treasure, man.